Всем привет, дорогие друзья, с вами Марс. Мы продолжаем проходить дополнение к Fallout 4 Far Harbor. В прошлой серии мы, собственно, взялись за расследование, взялись за поиски девушки, которая отправилась на этот остров в поисках поселения Си. Синтов. Да, остров не маленький. Надеюсь, прохождение будет интересным. Прикольно. Ты чокнутая? Мне не интересно. Нахер ты мне не нужна. Не хочу им помогать, блядь. После вот этой вот конченой, что-то мне как-то совсем не... Не хочется, не хочется. Я сюда пришел, блядь, вообще в поисках девушки. Вот. Здорово, короче. Прикольный у тебя плащ. Ну давай я тебя подкуплю. Не, пиво не надо. Хотя ладно, спасибо. Чему бы и нет? Дай-ка бутылочку мне. Бурбон. Ну вот весь кача мне. Пять бутылок пускай будет. Дун -дун 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 -дун. Дай бурбон тоже. Да, конечно. Держи свой виски. Пойдем. Да, очки стоит определенно поменять. А то они какие-то немножко багнутые. Похожу пока в этих. Блин, мне плащ твой нравится. Реально неплохой плащик. Я бы такой потаскал. Ну, 
case foul and sin. But it'll help. Hi. Don't stray too far. Так пошли, что ты вот это вот стал, старый козел. Смотрите, а туманы правда какой-то необычный. Ну, это эти люди человеки. Выходи, сука. Так, ну это обычная броня. Ух ты. Стрёмные какие-то животные. С тобой что-то явно не так. Его уже просто начинает хавать радиация. Но тут не особо такой высокий фон. Я думал, будет похуже. Хорошо стреляет. Как будто первый раз, честно слово. Это вот это вот она. Я тебя понял. Ну у тебя карабин, судя по всему. Hey, Пойдем. Или ты не идешь? Идешь. Пошли, пошли. Нихерашка. Like 
Them puppies. <laughs> Волки. Вот это забавно. Туманник. Прям как в этом. Прям как в Ведьмаке. Сейчас проверим. Но судя по звуку, это огромная тварь. Рыкнула она нормально. Молодой заглот. Неужели я не попал? Сука. Чудом. Да, интересно. Дальше пошли. Прикольное тут место, кстати. Атмосферное. Вот в Fallout я не видел особо атмосферы. Вот в Нью-Вегасе, да, там была атмосфера. Вот как-то вот те разрушенные города мне казались более реальными. Гули, что же еще, блядь. Спина к спине и разорвем их всех. Не переживай. Вот если стая заглотов нападет этих ублюдочных, вот это может быть проблема. А пока этого не происходит, все. Ты кто, мать твою? Well, I suggest you go no further. Acadia is a nest of snakes. Beasts that subvert the will of Adam. You do know you're crazy, right? Watch yourself, outsider. You walk through Adam's kingdom now. If you're done wasting time with a fanatic... Вы сомневались? Я нет. Пайпер это взбесило. Ну, ну и чё, и чё, и чё ты, блядь, сделаешь? Овца нахуй. В рот я тебя ёб. Пошли. Ты там не выебуйся, ты, блядь, моя подстилка в пустоши.
О, Аркадия. Я понял. Хорошо, старик, я к тебе обязательно загляну. Слыша, пойдем со мной. Пайпер отправляется похер куда. В ресторан в хижину иди. Не, подожди. Пайпер. Пайпер, обмен. Так, на вот тебе. Костюм Келлога и шляпу Минитменов. Шляпа серебряного плаща. И броню плаща я, пожалуй, заберу. Эй. Hey. Возьми, слышь, возьми шляпу, а. Я думаю, она тебе пойдет. Ты круто выглядишь просто. Мне твой костюмчик нравится. А ты, Пайпер, иди на все четыре стороны. Так, ну давайте сохранимся. Сделаем тут большое сохранение. Пошли внутрь. Что же нас ждет в Аркадии? Аркадия это местный, местное поселение Синтов. Посмотрим, что там внутри. Надеюсь, они не враждебны. You know, when I first climbed this mountain above the fog, I thought to myself, now here is a metaphor worth taking in. You've entered a place of clarity. Understanding. Peace. While you're here in Acadia, Synthkind welcomes you as long as you welcome us. Я ищу Касуми. I came here looking for Kasumi Nakano. Really? I'm impressed. Few would brave the kind of journey you've had for the sake of someone else. Kasumi is here. She's safe and unharmed, and you're free to see her if you'd like. Before you do, though, tell me, do you think Kasumi is a synth? Почему? Why are you asking? Because she came here with that very question, and the answer changes every part of her world. None of us take this transition lightly. She's facing the possibility of her entire life being a lie. That someone stripped her very identity from her. Но ее могли подменить определенно. She isn't. I want you to understand that before you see her. She has a chance here to live as a synth, not hiding, not pretending to be something else. One more question, if you'll indulge me. You're here for Kasumi, but I suspect there could be another reason you came to us. Tell me, are you a synth? <laughs> yeah, человек. I'm a human being, not a synth. Are you sure? I don't mean to question you, but what's the first memory you have? Day when we fell bombs. Да, 
Да, день, когда упали бомбы. Нет, не, ну была еще война, он же ветеран войны. We so easily accept what's presented to us as the truth, don't we? Isn't it funny how a memory can feel like a whole different reality? People, places, even sounds and colors can change. Не, ну я-то уверен, что я человек. Or someone else has changed them. I won't lie to you. There will always be other explanations. Trauma, disease, the background radiation. They all take their toll on the mind, but I can promise you that we will accept you, no matter what you decide you are. Где Касуми? I've heard enough. Where's Касуми Накано? Of course. Касуми is usually working down below. You can see her whenever you like. Acadia is open to you. Feel free to walk the grounds. Introduce yourself to my co-founders, Faraday and Chase. Did you need anything else before you go? Я из института. I'm just gonna tell you right now, Bima. I'm in the institute. That's quite an admission to make. Mm-hmm. I'm used to the institute striking from the shadows. I'll say this to you. I'm not your enemy. I only wish to live here, in peace, with my people. As a scientist, can you not see the value of independent synth life? You have a chance here to witness how wondrous that could be. All you have to do is do nothing. Don't tell your fellow researchers about us. Don't tell them we're here. Вы вернетесь добровольно. I don't suppose there's any way you and your people would return to the institute peacefully. I appreciate the offer. I do, actually. No one wants bloodshed, but we can't go back. And I'm not going to hide. If you want us, fine. But we'll fight for this. For Acadia's existence. Consider my offer. Don't say anything. What have you got to lose? Now, did you need anything else? Вы всего лишь аишники, вшитые в оболочку, похожую на человека, но вы не люди. Больше вопросов нет. Of course. Perhaps we're in there a long time. Are you feeling all right? I'm fine. You worry too much. Sometimes I feel like you don't worry enough. You know we blew three more relays this week. I'm coming in. You stay right there. No, подожди-ка. Don't have the key. У меня нет ключа. Так. Касуми работает ниже. Да, но тут нормальные такие подземелья, я смотрю. Творяй. Касуми Накано? Меня прислали твои родители. They want you to come home. They... they did what? You came all this way... for me. Went to some trouble, in fact. Took a walk through the fog to find you. Look, my mom and dad... I, I mean, those people that were taking care of me... They wouldn't want me back. Not if they knew the truth. Kasumi, listen to me. You're not a synth. Believe me, I've thought about that you can never really know but it just answers so many questions I thought if I just left it would be easier for them how would that conversation have gone anyway 
I've been lying to you this whole time? Your real daughter is dead and I replaced her? Ай, блядь. Откуда ты знаешь, что ты синт? Разные мелочи, сны, в которых я вижу. Детские годы. Да, похоже на то, что она синт, на самом деле. Но я должен ее вернуть. Мне кажется, ты просто запуталась. Касуми, я думаю, ты просто запутался. Каждый из них имеет сомнения о том, кто они иногда. Это часть жизни. Но не то, что другая часть работает с этими сомнениями? Не это, что я делаю? У меня были вопросы. Я пришла сюда, чтобы ответить на вопросы. Смотри, я не здесь, чтобы просто блинно следовать Акадия's идеям. Если что-то, я чувствую, как единственный, кто знает, что есть что-то неправильное здесь. Есть больше, чем просто разрушение. Я не могу уйти, пока я не да их вырезать надо просто. Пойдешь со мной? Нет, но ну это не вопрос, это угроза. Но почему бы и нет? That's what you do, right? That's why you came after me? What if I told you that there's a secret? A big secret here on this island. Something way more important than just one lost girl. <sighs> what are you talking about? Where to begin? You saw all those computers that Dima's hooked up to, right? They hold his memories or offload data from his brain. Or maybe some combination of both? Well, Faraday asked me to help do some repairs on them, and, you know, I got curious. There's like a century's worth of life experiences in there, and that's when I see it. Data models Dima has been making. One was the fog taking over Far Harbor. Another was a nuclear detonation on the island. Plus, death counts. What if Dima is so open and welcoming because he's actually hiding something from us? A plan to wipe out the rest of the island. Dima turning on Far Harbor? Now that would be cause for concern. Ну то, что ты ему не доверяешь, это понятно. Ладно, я помогу тебе. I'll help if I can, but that's not much to go on. I know, I've been working on that, but I haven't had much luck. I keep seeing Dima, Faraday, and Chase head into the laboratory at the other end of the hall. Then they come out later, looking like they've been arguing. There's actually a storage space right next to there. It'd be a perfect spot to hide an eavesdrop, but it's been locked up. I've also tried breaking into Faraday's terminal, since he and Dima are so close, but the security on it is crazy. Mm -hmm. Ладно, я разберусь. I'll figure this out. Just stay here. Okay. Good luck, and... Come back as soon as you've found anything. Whatever we find out, I hope there's a way to make some caps out of it. Я понял. Ладно. Действительно, давайте-ка с этим разберемся. В этой кладовой хранятся хровары для магазина. Не лезьте без спроса. Подряд, кому нужно попасть внутрь, ходить в магазин. Ты топчешься, как слон. Заходи.
We need to accomplish this without bloodshed. Far Harbor and the Children of Adam have a right to exist on this island, the same as us. They're going to kill each other, Dima. There's no stopping it. We oh, need to pick a side охотник. now. Haven't we already picked a side? Building the fog condensers around Far Harbor wasn't exactly a neutral act. We couldn't stand by and let the people of this island die to the fog. Just like you couldn't just leave the Cult of Adam without a home? Giving them the submarine base was a mistake. The Nucleus, as they're calling it, is basically one big fortified position. Far Harbor had cast them out. They have strange beliefs, but they have always accepted us for what we are. And Confessor Martin was a friend. Well, the new Confessor isn't. High Confessor Tectus is an unstable megalomaniac, and he's going to keep threatening us as long as we're helping Far Harbor. Guys, can we talk about the elephant in the room? We keep dancing around it. My old memory banks in the submarine base. I can't believe you never told me about those. I have to wait until they become a security risk. I know how it looks in hindsight. But at the time, it was an act of trust. I was honestly more worried they'd accidentally trip the pre-war security and get hurt, giving the children my old home, allowing them to safeguard my old memories. I thought our people would be working together. Just how secure the banks? How long do we have? And what's in them? I've gone over this before, Chase. I don't know what's in them. That's how it works. It's as close to forgetting something as I have. But I've run some projections of worst-case scenarios. If we do nothing and the wrong knowledge falls in the wrong hands... So send me over there. I'll be in and out in a day. We can't risk it. They know you're from Acadia. If you're caught or even seen, then it's war. We should at least prepare her to go in. We're running out of options. I say we tell her how to crack into the memory banks. You've been working on this without me? It came up in a private moment, Chase. But yes, we've been writing a program that will let you access and download my memories. It's not going to be like a normal hack. You'll be breaking through a version of my own mental network. It'll consider you to be an intruder. I've loaded the program with some instructions I've recorded that will help guide you through it. I'm afraid it's difficult to explain without seeing it for yourself. I'm finishing up some tweaks to the program right now. I'll leave a copy of it for you on my desk when I'm done. Get the program, use it to break into the memory banks. Got it. Hopefully you won't have to. We'll keep monitoring the situation. I only want you going in if we have no other choice. Interesting. Nothing I can think of to get rid of memories is because you don't like what's in them. Truth be told, it's half the reason I drink as much as I do. It's no, nay, never. No name, never, no more. I play the world over, no, never, no more. Starry, starry, alcoholic. Ну, я не умею хакать. Ну, давайте сделаем тут сейф. Воспоминания. I was hoping you were taking your time learning more about us. Huh. I suppose you have. Maybe this is an opportunity for both of us. 
I can't send any of my people without risking the children of Adam linking them back to Acadia. But you, you're new to the island. All right, I'm listening. Before I begin, how much do you know? Did you have any questions for me? About Far Harbor, the children of Adam, or my memories? Воспоминания. You left your memories behind? How does that work? As a prototype synth, my raw data capacity is limited. I began using computer banks to expand, to give me room to ponder, see new things. I had to leave some of my earliest memories behind when I left the sub-base to the Children of Adam. I thought they were safe. Дети Атома. The Children of Adam on this island. You were helping them? Yes. I know their faith in radiation as a type of god is a bit... different. But who am I to judge? I was using a submarine base as a home when Martin and his followers stumbled inside. They had been cast out of Far Harbor for their beliefs. When I left to found Acadia, I knew the base would be in safe hands. They needed a home, a place to belong, just like I did. But now Martin is gone, and his successor, Tectus, wants to finally end the feud with Far Harbor by letting the fog swallow them. Но расскажи ещё про Far Harbor. Keeping Far Harbor safe, is that it? Not exactly. They're fiercely independent. But the fog was starting to choke more and more of the island. So I proposed a trade. We would give them the technology to keep the fog at bay. In return for them being a lifeline to the outside world. A safe dock and a place to buy supplies. Unfortunately, the children of Adam view the radioactive fog as a holy portent, and their bloodied history with Far Harbor puts us at odds. Ясно, но они мне определенно мешают. Then my plan is simple: pose as a recruit and infiltrate the children of Adam, gain access to their base in the old command center, guarded by some pre-war security measures. You'll find my memory banks. I'll give you the program you need in order to access my memories. Bring me anything you find. It's not going to be like a normal hack. You'll be breaking through a version of my own mental network. It'll consider you to be an intruder. I've loaded the program with some instructions I've recorded that will help guide you through it. I'm afraid it's difficult to explain without seeing it for yourself. Уже у меня. Actually, I already have the program. I was thorough. Well, I guess that just means I've picked the right person for the job. One more thing before you leave. Whatever you do, don't assault the children of Adam directly. Почему? Our ultimate goal must be to bring peace. If you attack them, they'll consider themselves at war with the outside world. I've got no love for those mindless fanatics in the nucleus. I won't complain if it comes to violence. Hell, I'm hoping it does. Ну пошли ещё пообщаемся с Касуми, раз такое дело. Расскажем ей о суровых реалиях данного места. Turns out Dima's earliest memories are in the hands of the children of Adam. He's afraid of what they're going to find. So, is that what those death projections were about? It wasn't Dima planning to destroy the island. He's worried the children of Adam will. Or is he still hiding something? What could be in those memories that he would leave them behind? Вот это мы узнаем. Really something in them that's dangerous? Do you have a way in? Into his memories? Assuming you can get Да, есть некая программа. I got this program that Faraday and Dima wrote. It's supposed to help me access the memory banks. Really? How would that work? When I was taking a peek in the computers he has here, 
Demo was hooked up to his chair. I was just tapping into it. I wonder if you'll need to, you know, connect to the old banks the way he does? Some kind of connection between your head and the computer. Oh, but that's it. And then Faraday's program would be translating Dima's thoughts and data, helping you through any security guarding it. I'm sorry, I'm making assumptions. It's just... Yeah, they well, it's a little exciting, isn't it? You'll let me know what you find? I'll keep an eye on things here. Ладно, не волнуйтесь. I'll get Dima's memories. And then we'll figure things out from there. Good luck. 500 крышек. Хуеть. Судя по всему, на мне просто работает эффект стелсбоя. Ну это ладно. Что ж, дорогие друзья, давайте-ка, пожалуй, на этом я и закончу сегодняшнюю серию. Всем спасибо за просмотр. С вами был Марс. Увидимся в следующих роликах. Всем пока. До новых видео.